Hello guys and welcome back. My name is Lado and today we're gonna play some more League of Legends So we're playing Master Yi and I know the previous game I've posted was also on Master Yi But this time I want to try something different So we're gonna pick up our normal starting items if we're in the jungle which are five health potions and 100 machete and one warding trinket So Let's see, we're gonna close this tab and go into our own jungle. So apparently we will not invade and being Master Yi, I'm gonna start off blue buff. I like having my blue buff first because you can get a little bit, uh, you know, mana hungry in the jungle. Of course we start off a strike. So I'll tend to pick up my blue buff first and then I'll go to my red after which I can uh, complete a successful gank either mid or bot. But Master Yi in his new patch, patch 4.5, is really OP in my opinion. And I don't know, in my previous game I posted, I got a quadra kill, and I think that kind of made my point. But today I want to make something different to even, no, make it more clear. Oh, aren't they giving me a, le me a leash? Yucks, what the, what the hell? Give me a leash. Oh my god. Okay, well. We'll do it out, Lisa, Lisa, I guess, I guess. So we're gonna smite this one, pop our pot, and get this blue buff down. And we got a blue buff, nice. Um, let me see, I'm gonna pick up Wuju style, I suppose. I like Wuju style a lot, it gives uh, a lot of uh, buffs to your attack, uh, attack damage. So, I'm gonna kill the wit. And actually, what I'll be trying to do today is um, taking down the Baron pretty early. So we're gonna try to take the Baron down at 15 minutes. So I have to uh, do a little investigation. At 450 gold, we need to go back to the shop to buy our Madras Madrids. And that's really important because uh, Madrids gives you uh, a lot of extra clearing speed and that's really important. So pop your health potions while running. Take down uh, the wraiths, and then we'll have enough for our meditate to heal up a little bit. Here it is. Now we're gonna heal up. Let's see how our lane's doing. Quite good. Maybe I should get off a uh, kill med, but first I'm gonna recall. I don't actually know if what I'm doing is correct, you know, because I'm not having my red buff, so I hope it won't get stolen. So it's kind of a risky play here. But in my opinion, it's kind of worth it. Uh, the Madras gives you a lot more uh, clear speed. And then we have to go back again at 900 to get up our uh, stacks for uh, Riddle's Lantern as fast as possible. Because you want your uh, Feral Flare as no as fast as possible. That's really essential playing Master Yi in the jungle. Also, as you can see, I have my teleport. So I can always perform a teleport gang or so so something like that. So the kill is asking for some help, so maybe you should uh, do a gank after we've picked up our, our red buff over here. So also something I would like to mention is that I'm uh, using full attack speed rune, so I have 41% extra attack speed at level 1. Which is pretty strong, I suppose. So let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna do a gank. Although we do not have our ulti. I'm gonna try see if we can set up a gank here. Ah, uh, kind of sucks. Probably misplayed this one. I uh, didn't you know because I'm running teleport. I ha do not really have a gap closing spell, and that's kind of annoying. Could have been a kill, but at least he he should be out of lane or he's staying apparently, which is kind of dumb in my opinion. Most of my lanes actually need help, but then, but really, as ye, it's all about farming. So maybe I should help out the ox. Maybe let me see. I'm gonna farm my way up to the top lane. Uh, it's hard to gank anyway. Uh, before level six, being master ye, you really need your um, your attack speed and your gap closing ulti, which is your highlander, which is really important. So I tend to ma max my Alpha Strike, it's your most important spell, it saves your life so many times, it's insane. 
So we're gonna take down this one and now we're gonna perform a gank. And uh, let's see, maybe we should be able to pick up a gank. Although I said before, it sometimes it tends to it tend to be hard to gank being mastery. So Yak should initiate with his stun. And we pick up the kill. A red buff too strong. So the first uh, kill has been taken. Now we're gonna go to mid because Kel is asking for it. Apparently she's out of mana. So that kind of sucks. Um, because that way she won't be able to slow him with her uh, Q. Uh, let me see. Although he's really pushed. Yeah, I couldn't really fully commit to to the gank because it was kind of risky. I didn't want to kill my, I have myself killed. Oh, so he survived, but kill can go back. No, well, actually he's staying. So I'm gonna heal up and pop my ulti and kill the bitch. And kaboom! Here we go, Master E2 strong. So the reason why we won that fight is kind of, kind of obvious because we were level 6 and he wasn't. Oh crap. And kaboom! Another kill! Yeah. It's really hard to solo a uh, Master E, apparently after level 6. So as you can see, I'm pretty strong now. Already 3 kills. I'm gonna go back, need a health, need a mana, I'm gonna buy a lot of insane items on this E. So things are going pretty good I suppose. So we're gonna pick up this one as first. And next thing you wanna wanna pick up is your Berserker Grease for the movement speed, really. You need to catch up to people. And what we're also gonna buy, my beloved Vision Ward. No, in my opinion, Vision Ward after Feral Flare is a OP item. So definitely should pick one up of these. Gonna uh, donate blue buff to the Kale. If she comes, we'll see. So now it's all about killing um, the big monsters as fast as possible because you really need your Feral Flare. So we're gonna go for it. Come on, please come Kel, I really can't wait. Oh, she's actually in the middle of a fight. Come on, yeah, I guess I'm gonna take it myself then. No, you can use, use blue buff too. Probably gonna do a gank top. Oh, is he going to dive? Yeah, probably will have to hold the lane. So gonna ult here. And picking up the kill, okay, nice. This is looking quite good guys. So let's um, level would you style, um, it's a much more important spell. Then, uh, then the meditate, of course. So let's get back to farming. I said before, I've mentioned this so many times already. It's all about farming. Gonna pop my vision one of. Oh crap! Is it not in the bush? I hope it is. Oh, I don't quite know. It seems like it isn't in the bush, so that really sucks. Like, that's like worst placed placed ward ever. So. What I'm actually gonna do, I'm gonna pick up my red buff, and after my red buff, I'm gonna try to do a solo Baron at level uh, 10 minutes in the game. That should be able, because the thing I'm trying to accomplish here is getting a Baron at level 15, so a Dragon at level 10 should be possible, at least. No. Gonna gonna not smite this red buff, because I want to... Oh crap, seems like Kel's in some trouble. So I'm gonna have to help her first. Maybe can pick up a kill on Talon, not quite sure though. Ah, oh, she dub we double warded it. So let me see. Yeah, not quite gonna do it. I'm gonna just gonna go for the crap. Okay, I'm just gonna go for the solo dragon here. So this is looking quite good, I should say. And kaboom, we got the solo dragon. 
So let's get back to farming. We already have 15 stacks, so 10 more to go. Just farm it up, guys. It's all about farming, playing as he. I'm already 4 0, so that's quite, kind of great. He is also a great carry, so taking kills as he is really good because you can just uh, single handedly carry the game on your own. Yeah, <laughs> worst place, worst uh, ward placement ever. Yeah. Whatever, what do you do? Gonna meditate it up. I really, I can't uh, really gank top because I don't have my ulti yet, so I want to farm, but there's no creeps nearby, so I'm just gonna push mid, take the tower maybe, or maybe kill the talent. or he kills me. Okay, badly played, I admit it. So next item we really need before we can solo the Baron is Blade of the Rune King. So let's pick up this one and this one. So we need 1400 gold in order to do it. So yeah, I was kind of misplayed there, you know, he was able to burst me down quite hard. So when everyone is demanding a gang, so that's kind of sucky because really I just want to farm it up and get my Feral Flare and do the solo Baron. That's the point of this video, to be honest. Oh, I should go mid. Kale's doing quite some good work, but sadly enough, not enough, not quite enough. Maybe she gets the E. Oh, so close. That was really close. So first, we're gonna see if we can get this talent. Apparently, he's gonna back off. So that means free farm for us. So push the lane. And gonna farm my way to the bottom lane. So we almost got 20 stacks. And everyone is really demanding them ganks. Come on, I just want to farm. I'm ye, I farm. That's all I do. Farm and win. That's how you have to play the E. Blue buff is up so we can take that one. Let's see how are we doing. We have almost the most farm of our team. Being jungle, that's really great. So we're gonna take the blue buffs ourselves. And I got a level 2 ult, which is great too. It's awesome. And we need two more stacks after this one. And we got the Feral Flare. So let me see, the chase is not quite low. Should... I'm just gonna hold the lane there. Get some free farm. Because otherwise he might take the tower, because the tower is quite low. And I'm gonna go mid. If she survives, probably not. It sucks. See if you can pick up the kill on this. And we got it. Okay, good. Should meditate and probably go bot. And yeah, the Jax picks up the kill, that's awesome. But before we can go bot, I really want my Feral Flare. And yeah, the Twitch is really mad at me at the moment. Because I haven't paid him a gank. So first gonna get this one. Then I got my Feral Flare. And the red buff which will I'm gonna do like one more over here. So let's see if we can gank. We can get the gank off. He's ohm, so he probably won't be able to run away, but apparently he's just running away, so
he has probably recalled so let's see but something we also really need to buy is a spirit stone which costs 700 so we need like 1600 for the butker butterk and 700 for the spirit stone which we need, which we will need so you have to farm a little bit more is she gonna going to help me no she's pretty low yeah I got one kill, we played it badly. At least now we have enough for all the items we need. So we're gonna pick up this one. Let me see, um, Spirit Stone we also need. It's over here. And the next item is Yumu's Ghost Blade we're going to buy. So, uh, it's over here. And I'm gonna pick a long sword. yeah. And like some health potions. You probably will need that to solo the the Baron. So gonna gonna ask them not to help me. And yeah. Wish me best of luck I should say. Yeah, <laughs> okay, let's try it. So we're gonna pick our Wuju style here and activate our ulti for more damage. Oh, this is looking bad. Yeah, me dead. So I wasn't quite yet able to do it. So I think this kind of shows the point that it's not OP, but he's really OP. So we're gonna, gonna just get the game on. It was kind of a fail, I should say. I thought I was able, you know. I would, I no. If someone would help me, or like a top player and mid laner would help me, I would definitely be able to take it down. But for the moment, you know, I'm just gonna have to help my team and just just yeah, farm it up and wait a little while before I can take down the solo Baron. So let's see, let's go, go top. Actually I have my teleport so I'm gonna go to here, here with my teleport. Picking up the triple kill. So it was really worth it, of course. I'm gonna take tower and then we're gonna transition into the dragon. Which we, luckily enough, will be able to solo. So I, I didn't even use my botker, motork. So let's see, so we're gonna solo. The dragon quite easily. Don't even have to pop my ult. And now let's go to the mid lane. Now it's gonna be gonna be hard to get off a gank here. He's really cautious, uh, the Talon. So let's farm a little bit more. Oh, the Xinzao is over there. Okay. See, we're gonna do a counter gank over here. Oh, the Twitch is getting. Oh. Oh, come on, he killed me. 
Yeah, but yeah, I was able to got a triple kill, I suppose, so that's quite nice. So that was pretty good. Uh, probably, yeah, just take the Taya, they got him. He's dead. Come on. Come on, it's like 4 vs 1. Hey, don't pick him up. Okay, so let's see, we're gonna pick our Yumu's Gold Blade. Let's see, what active does this give? Grant 20% movement speed and 40% extra attack speed, awesome. So we're gonna put it over here, over here, and over here. Actually, we're gonna sell our health pods, don't really need it anyway. And next item we'll need is Lost Whisper. Or uh, yeah, no, actually, yeah, we're gonna pick up the Lost Whisper. I think now we should have the items to do a solo Baron. Should I risk it? I I don't really know. Let's see. Maybe we can just fight them over here. Oh, there's a fight happening. Okay, got two kills for two. But Lucian picking up the double kill and not a shutdown. Okay, luckily enough, he didn't got a shutdown on me. I was kind of afraid for that. Uh, so, next thing we're gonna pick up is like the home guard, which we'll really need. Yeah. Okay, I don't really know what to do. My red buff is gone. I don't know who picked it up. Maybe, no, I'm just gonna do split push Yi. So split push Yi is in the house. Getting towers till the inhibitor. You know, there's like no champion that can 1v1 me at this moment right now. I'm really fat. I'll do like one shutting minions. And one shutting minions. That's how strong I am. Okay, it picked up Dixon Xiao. I'm taking tower so fast. Gonna pop my ulti for this one, otherwise I think I would not be able to take it down. And seems like my team is doing a good job. Though, yeah, I probably will be able to get the inhibitor I suppose. That would be freaking awesome. Ah, crap. You stupid Xian Xiao. So, Lost Whisper is the next item. And then the final item will be obviously the Infinity Edge for the extra attack. A critical chance. So, I'm gonna do a 25 minute Baron, solo Baron. That's That seems fair too. You know, like a solo Baron at 25 minutes is pretty cool too. It's not as cool as a 15 minute Baron though, but uh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so they are going to let me do it. I have everything up. I have my Yumus. I have my ulti. So, let's see. I really wonder if I will be able to do it. Hopefully they don't have a ward, you know, it's kind of risky, but I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it, I'm a risky player. Oh my god. This Baron is so going down, I could have 1v1 him much earlier. Now all I have to do is smite it right at 900 lives. 
and I got him. Oh my god, I'm, I'm even full life. Oh, look who's here. I'm gonna steal your attack speed, dude. Thanks. Yeah. Baron buff too strong. Yeah, it probably is the game. Solo Baron, 25 minutes. Seems legit. Seems legit. And really this video is all about uh, showing that Master Yi is at the moment the most broken champion in patch 4.3. I hope I kind of made, made that clear because that's really the, the whole point of this video. It's like free elo for you guys. It's free elo. Go on ranked and play Master Yi. If you don't play him, at least ban him. Because he's so OP with the new Feral Flare item, it's insane. Okay, I have to back out here though. Let's see how this goes. I'm probably gonna pick up Leona, so that's an assist from me. Not quite worth it, but we got the inhibitor, so... So let's see, we I'm going to sell this item and buy our Infinity Edge. Look, we're almost full build. Oh no, we actually can still sell the Feral Flare, of course. So, Infinity Edge is over here. Actually, I'm gonna sell the Feral Flare. I don't actually know that's a good thing if you have to keep the fair flare or should sell it. I think you should sell it though. Like uh, Spirit of Lizard Elder, you sell that item too when you're full build, so. No, I don't really know. So then there's the one last item we should have to pick up. I don't quite know, like the most freaking awesome item of course is Zephyr. I'm probably gonna pick that one up. This item is just insane. Actually I have my teleport up, so I'm gonna teleport over here over here. And then take down the tal talent. Where are you, Talon? Show yourself! And we picked up a triple kill. I wonder, I, I probably have like three triple kills in this game? <laughs> no, it's insane. So if the trash can tank, I, I will be able Okay, we're gonna take down this one too, and this is going to be the game, I suppose. Let's see if we can get some kills before we end this one. I shouldn't like uh, how it's called Alpha Strike on him because he could just walk into the fountain and then I would be dead. So I don't like that. But that was a good game. It was pretty short, 28 minutes or something. So what well, awesome game, Baron Solo Baron, 25 minutes. Probably could have done it at 20 minutes, so I just assume I would be able to do it at 20 minutes. No, a solo Baron at 20 minutes, that's like a Baron buff in the laning phase. That is just so freaking OP. And at the moment, in my opinion, Master Yi is like just as OP as Nunu was back, Nunu Jungle was OP back in patch 3.8. So probably they're gonna patch uh, Master Yi in the, in the next... Uh, next patch he's definitely gonna get a nerf you know because with the new item feral flare it made master Yi really strong it offers all the stats master Yi needs and you no know, it, it grants you so much advantage because you can just sit in the jungle farm it up you know, get them kills really easily with the feral flare because it gives you a lot of uh, offensive stats it's, it's just the, like the perfect item on master Yi. I'm still like tweaking my build a little bit like for example I'm using full attack speed rune, so I have 41% extra attack speed. I don't quite know if that's the right thing to do. I'm gonna mess around with it, see if there's other runes or masteries I could use. Also like the teleport, not quite sure. It's a good for uh, backdooring and like split pushing, but not really that good in the early phase to pick up skills or save your, save your life. So sometimes I like to prefer taking the flash, you know, just to have that extra survivability. But overall, this was a pretty good game. I liked it a lot. If you like it too, and you think the uh, mastery is broken at this time with a Feral Flare, leave a comment below and say what your score was in owning it up against Scrubs. Take that ELO, guys. Take that ELO. Go to Diamond. Maybe even Challenger. Whatever. Go to LCS and play Master Yi. I'll be there to support you. So, if you like this video, don't forget to a like. 
put some comments below or read them and try to answer and of course as always don't forget to subscribe because you'll get updated when a new champion gets OP. So thanks for watching, have a great day and have a great life.